Which of the following statements are true? 1. The factors of 24 are 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12. Now when we're thinking about factors, we're thinking about numbers that actually fit into the, this original number, 24. So we know that 2 fits into 24. 2 times 12 is 24. 3 fits in as well. 3 times 8 is 24. 4, a bunch of 4s also fits into 24. 4 times 6 is 24. 6 also fits in, 8 as well as 12. Now this question is a bit tricky because even though that these are factors, so are the numbers 1 and 24, which is the number itself. So all these, all numbers have factors uh, 1 and itself. So this is a kind of a trick question. So this here is wrong because we're missing these uh, the beginning and the end factors. Number two, the prime factorization of 24 is 2 to the exponent 3 times 3 to the exponent 1. Let's test this out here. We have the number 24. Break it down. Prime factorization. 24 is the same thing as 6 times 4, which is the same thing as 2 times 3, and 4 can be broken down to its factors 2 times 2. So when you think about this, this essentially is 2 to the exponent 3, 2 times 2 times 2, times 3 to the exponent 1. That's all the factors broken down. So the prime factorization essentially is a number broken down to all its factors and grouped together nicely so that we have exponents. So this is correct. Number 3. The prime factors of 24 are 2 and 3. So the prime factor is when you factor out this, the number, it's all the bases. So we have a base 2 and we have a base 3. So indeed, the prime factors are 2 and 3. Choice number 4. So the square root of 24 is an irrational number. Well, we know that the square root of 9 equals 3, and 3 is not irrational. So we need to do a little test here. How do we know that this is not that this doesn't simplify to a simple uh, number, natural number. Well, let's uh, simply rewrite it as square root of, let's break it down to its factors, uh, 2 times 2 times 2, we broke it down already, times 3. Now we know that we can collect pairs because this here the square root sign is essentially index 2 so for every two friends we pull out one of them so this essentially is equals to 2 root 2 times 3 and we can't we can no longer simplify this so when we have 2 root 6 we cannot simplify this we know that this is your the radical symbol is going to stay and remain so this here is considered irrational. When we have a radical symbol that can't be simpl simplified any further, the number is irrational. So this also is correct. So choices 2, 3, 4 are correct, which leads us to choose choice C.